Okay, 5B5, it's basically a copy of 2B2, just like 9B9, T. Oh wait, what should I name it? Let's name it, uh, maybe half the views. 9B9, T is basically bootleg 2B2, T, exactly like 5B5, T. But, when I recorded it, Finn just screwed around in it, the recording got corrupted. And then some really cool guy just came by and gave me a kit. And now I'm really stacked, so it wouldn't be fun to record or watch, so, uh, yeah. So I didn't even know 5v5t even existed. I just put 1v1t, 2v2t, all the, all the bts, and this one worked, so, yeah. It's got, a, like, around the same, a little bit less players than 9v9t, but I guess it's still basically bootleg, uh, 2v2t. The reason I can't play normal 2v2t is because I'm not paying $20 for priority access, and I have to wait like 13 hours because I'm in 300 spots in queue because it's a big server and it just can't handle all the players. All right, um, when I tried to join it, it said like, we're verifying your connection, but let's join it. And here we are, okay, we're on um, uh, in 5v5t. It looks very similar to the spawn of 9v9t. Let's look around. By the way, I'm not hacking, I'm on Lunar Client, as you can see, it's all Lunar Client. I have Free Look enabled, so I can just look around like this, instead of just F5, like this. So, that's pretty useful. Uh, I guess we should go try to find another portal, I guess? I mean, that worked in 9 90 so I guess that's what we gotta do. There's wood here, so this should come in very useful. Please. Is it just a shulker box sitting there? Wait, is there anything in it? Let's see, let's see. Oh, no, okay, it looks like it was abandoned. Um, okay, there's an e-chest here. Uh, I can open it, perfect. Let's, um, throw this wood in here. I, now that I've played 9B9T, I'm a little bit experienced with the Anarchy server environment, but I'm nowhere near perfected with it. So I'll probably do a lot of things wrong. But when I was playing 9B9T, the recording just got fully corrupted, which is very annoying, but, you know. Alright, we got, um, five wood. Um, can I, I don't, no, I can't pick that up. I think I need, wait, do I only need a wood pick? I think I might only need a wood pick, and then I can pick up a shulker box. <gasps> wait, is that another shulker? There's another shulker. Maybe there's something in that one. Let's go check. I doubt it. Okay. Uh, am I trapped down here now? Um... I think I might just be trapped down here. I mean, well, we, okay, first death. Oh, 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 okay. Um, are you friendly? Are you friendly? <gasps> There's two of them. There's th four. Oh my God, they're all fighting. Hello, friendly, friendly, friendly. The ping on the server is, oh God, okay. You are not friendly. Wait, wait a second. Okay, so some of you might be wondering why I was so confused here. Well, I had just seen one of my old friends, Skifu, in this Anarchy server. He was one of my old friends from Sandlot. We still kind of kept up to each other, but we weren't, like, we didn't communicate that much. If you have been with the channel for a long time, you would have known that, um... In my Let's Go Pikachu Nuzlocke all the way back in, like, May, I named a Pokemon after him. And I just found him again. So. Wow. That's someone from Sandlot. Sandlot's a family-friendly server I play. Oh, wait, there's, there's a guy. Oh, God, okay. <clears throat> all right. All right, I'm asking for help to escape spawn now. All right, I'm friending him on Discord. All right, I got him on Discord. All right, I asked him if he could help me with, like, escaping spawn and stuff. The most genius question. Yes, he said yes. Okay, quick, quick disclaimer in case you think I'm uh, recording him without his permission. Um, he knows I'm recording a YouTube video. Alright, I'll send him my cords. Alright, I send him my cords in-game and in Discord. <laughs> I love that profile picture. Okay, so, while Skifu... Wait, is there anything in this shulker? 
No, bro. I guess, I guess they've just all been looted. Um, there's a new player. Let's see. I wonder if they're hacking. Are, are they friendly? Oh, oh, okay. Okay. Hmm. Hmm, okay. Well. Well. No, leave me alone. Don't, no, just don't kill me. Why? Come on, bro. A bee hopper is trying to kill me. Oh my god. No, run. Do, 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 do. Ah, ah, ah. There's another guy behind me. Oh my god. It's ski. Get the bee hopper. Oh god. I'm so low. Oh, he's giving me uh, elytras. Do you have food? Oh, yes. They gave me uh, a few, a couple stacks of god gaps. He, he needs an HSC's dupe kit. Or he found an HSC. He has like dupe kits, I apparently. My goal on this server is to uh, get a kill, I guess. He said here. Oh, yes. Oh my gosh, there's so many. Oh, look at all these different kinds of kits. Oh, pained apple. Oh, there we go. Okay. The e chest is literally full. All right, let's open one of these. I think I should be able, able to open one here. <gasps> oh my god, dude! Elytras. I wonder if Elytras even work on this server, bro. Oh, he, okay. oh, sorry, BRB. I have to do something. Uh, I'm just gonna ignore the pained apple guy for now. I think he, yeah, Ski DM'd me. Don't freak out when pain when pained apple. I said. I sent him to you. So let me just put some of these like duped stuff in here. I really want to try out the elytra. We've got stacked pots of string. I think I'm just going to be walking around with all the stuff on me because I can't put it anywhere. I don't have enough space anywhere. Crystal PVP ultimate kit. What's this? Let's see what's in. Oh, oh yeah. There's curse of vanishing on these totems. All right. I'll take these. Oh, there's swiftness pots. Okay. We'll take those. All right. I guess we're going with this. Okay. Um, I guess I should just continue on. Who knows, maybe I can get revenge on that bee hopper. All right, I think now we should head to the nether. Oh God, okay, I just fell down here. As you can see, we've applied some epic shaders. So I have on full bright as well. I guess I should just go to the nether now. The nether's probably a ton more dangerous. So we'll see how this goes. I have a lot of e-pearls now, so I can just use them whenever I want. All right, let's head through here. That we haven't. Oh no. Uh oh. Oh, they're. Oh no, they're holding end crystals. Okay, so me might be uh, wondering why I'm afraid of this guy. Well, this guy, he was holding end crystals. End crystals are the most powerful um, obtainable item, legitimately, probably in the entire game of Minecraft, only matched by the 32k swords from 2v2t. But those aren't even obtained legitimately using hacks or uh, um, access to the server or like OP commands, that kind of stuff. So this guy just pulled out end crystals, and the reason I think why he wasn't actually blowing up the end crystals was because we were at height limit. You can see when I was placing down um the uh, end, no, when I was trying to place my end crystals, I couldn't because we were at height limit. So I guess uh, I was guessing with my little chicken brain that that was what he was trying to do. So I decided I would have to take him out because he wanted to fight. Taking him down.
So yeah, that was my experience with an Anarchy server. Now there will probably be a part two, seeing as this was really, really fun to record and maybe even edit. I mean, editing is never fun. But um, if uh, you enjoyed watching, please do subscribe. I really need this. My mom's raising me 200 subs. Uh, I'm at 79 right now, but she's catching up quick. She's at four subscribers. P please subscribe. Okay, bye.